<laughs> yeah, hello everyone. My name is Omega Zero, and I'm actually back here with more Final Fantasy VII. The original, not the remake. As you remember, in the last episode, we got Cloud's level for the Limit Break on these level. However, there's another character who's Limit Break who we can get, and it requires us to go to Mount Nibble! Well, actually, Nibbleheim. And guess what? There's only one character who has a connection to Nibbleheim that's actively in our party, and that is Tifa. Now, I believe is she in my party. Yes, Tifa is in my party, and I don't think you need her to be here, but what you want to do is you want to go to Tifa's house, and you want to actually go up to the second floor. After going up to the second floor, you're going to go into her room and jam on her piano. Now, if you don't remember how it goes, you can say, oh, I go for it, and, and say you forget, but then you get the typical, like, things for La Fessy. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, ti, la, <laughs> so, fa, mi, re, do, stuff like that. And you say end, this allows you to, well, f allow you to play on it. You say, ah, uh, go for it, and then if you say, I remember, you get the chance to play it. And what you want to do is you want to input this code number uh, in the screen, and I'll put it at the bottom. I heard this melody somewhere before. I played it well. And by having Tifa here, she has the sheet music for that song. And if you actually read it, Tifa, what happened to our town? Was it all an illusion or just a dream? No, it was neither. I remember trying to get people out of the flames but not having the strength. Burning with anger, I went to the reactor to kill Sephiroth. But he was nowhere to be found. Instead, I found you collapsed inside. I felt saving you was far more important than going after Sephiroth. There were several others that were still alive inside, but I was only able to save you. As I was coming out of the reactor, Shin reduced for just arriving. I recall a scientist named Hojo was in charge. He ordered the troops to gather up everyone still alive for the experiment. I didn't know what type of experiment he was talking about, but I wasn't about to let them have my dearest student. Putting you on my back, I headed down the mountain to the village. I used a cure spell on you many times. I started to head for Midgard to look for a doctor for you. I didn't like that city, and my cure spells weren't helping. I decided to go to Midgard to find a doctor I could trust. I'm worried about you, but I can't settle down in one place for very long. Have you recovered fully? Are you well? I wonder how many years have passed since then. I just got into town again, but I can't believe it. The whole town was back to normal, except for strange people with black clothes on. The town reeks of Shinra. But I won't go after them. You may think I'm running from them, but it's just that I don't want anything to do with Shinra anymore. Feels like time is running out. I'm sure you'll find this letter and this gift for you. It should come in handy. I can't even jump anymore, but I hope you continue to sharpen your skills and remember what I taught you. To my most precious student, from Zangu. And you receive Final Heaven! <laughs> for getting ready to use Final Heaven on Sephiroth. And, if you notice, Final Heaven is Tifa's level 11th break. And, we can go give it to her. Well, I still need to give the high wind to Sid, Frank. I still need to guard, grind for him. Gosh. But yeah, head all the way down because it will be at the bottom. Final Heaven, give it to Tifa. Hmm, so that's it. And it is basically like how it always is, and as you can see, we'll reset it. We'll reset this because, you know, set. There we go. So that way we don't have, you know, like full limits going for us most of the time. So what we need to do is actually now head to the City of the Ancients because we've been putting that off for too long now. So, let's hurry up. Triple speed, let's go. Because remember, Boogie Hoggins said the only way to stop Meteor now is with the Might Materia. And Aerith was trying to cast that before she tried to... Before she was, you know, unfortunately ended by Sephiroth. So, let's head back there. And you can land in this area, like, right here. 
So you're gonna head back there. <sighs> it feels like forever ago that we were here. But we're the only ones that can stop Sephiroth now. So what you wanna do is go over here. I believe it's this area, right? No, it's not. It's the wrong part. <laughs> what we need to do is that we actually need to go back. And I love the city of the ancients. And now I want like an entire game based around that previous time period. I don't know how you would do it. Like make it like probably like this last hurrah type of deal in order to stop them. Because even though Genova comes in and wrecks everyone, moving on. This is yes, exactly. Uga, what are you doing? He's flying to the center. Are you getting something? Give me a moment. And we follow Bugenhag into the center. And bam! New part. The knowledge of the ancients swirling around here is telling me one thing. The planet's in a crisis. A crisis beyond human power or endless time. It says when time comes, we search for holy. Holy? Holy, the ultimate white magic. Magic that might stand against Meteor. Perhaps our last hope to save the planet from Meteor. The soul seeking holy reaches the planet. It will appear. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Meteor, weapon, everything will disappear. Perhaps even ourselves. Even us? It's up to the planet to decide. What is best for the planet? What is bad for the planet? All that is bad will disappear. That is all. <laughs> I wonder which we humans are. Knowing us, it probably will be bad. In fact, if this is our humans, we probably would definitely be categorized in the bad area. Search for holy. How do we do it? Speak to the planet. Get the light materia. This will bound the planet to you. Bond the planet to you. Then speak to the planet. If our wish reaches the planet, the wet material will begin to glow a pale green. This is the end. Aerith had the white materia. But when Aerith died, it fell from the altar. That's why this is the end. Hoo hoo hoo! Look at this! Hmm? What the? Ancient's writings. Can you read it? It's all Greek to me. Is there Greece in this world? Ugh. This ain't no time for this. I'm not ancient. I can't read this thing. <laughs> I may be old, but my eyes aren't completely bad yet. Look closely below the ring. There's something red and shot. Even sunlight can't reach key. It's probably written by a scientist who had been here. He must have used all his energy just to interpret these words. Key. So what? Keyblade? Kingdom Hearts? I don't know, but it probably has something to do with our riddle. Because then we must have something to do with Aaron. So this now points to where the key is? Probably. Use these words as clues to go find the key. I'll continue to figure out the agent's writing. Place. Even sunlight works, is where the key is, right? When you find the key or where you can't go any further, come back here. Maybe I'll understand more from the writing and get some new information for you. Alright. <sighs> this is weird. I know where. I think I remember where it's at, the white materia, because this part of the game I do not remember uh, where we're supposed to go look for. It. Like, let me look it up while I'm, like, kind of searching. I'm assuming all we gotta do is just go back to where Aerith died. Uh, let me see. Let's see. Key Riddle FF7. Okay, correct. So, like I said, we're...
Okay, so here it is. Return, take your left hand to score, bring a hand, grab a right. Approach, head right on the upper hallway and down on stairs. Approach the glowing object, suspend it in the middle of the hall. Go behind will send you find a key center for even sunlight like coverage. Go back to the high room and head for the Shinra sub. Ah, crap. Okay. Where is the Shinra sub? Somewhere over here. Alright, so man, imagine the power of this crap about the guy. That'd be a nightmare. Okay, so what we need to do is that we need to go back to the highway and head for the Shinra sub. From Junon, take the sub north along the eastern perimeter of the ocean. Pass through a narrow canyon and find a hidden tunnel that will take you to the northern continent. What? Crap, okay. Okay, ah, crap. Ignore that! We are ignoring the ever loving crap out of that! Because if we don't, we will die. Which is a good thing because. Well, not a good thing because, good lord, that thing is horrifying. Says, take along the eastern perimeter to find a hidden cave that will take you to the north continent. Is it like what, right here or something? I don't know. I don't know where this cave is. This is what sucks about like this old game, even though I love it. Like you don't know where certain things are. What the? Oh, is this it? Estimated to be several thousand years old. Key of the Ancients. Oh, never mind. There it is. Can we go up from here? No, of course not. How much you want to bet that Emma Web is like, hey, yo, what's good? <laughs> like, just chilling right there. That'd be horrifying. But I'm not going to deal with that crap. What we're going to do is that we're going to head back to Junon on the surface and not deal with Emerald Web just suddenly showing up like, hey, what's good? Yeah, no, not doing that. And yeah, the Shinra sub can only go into what this game classifies as deep waters. That being the um, blue, dark blue ocean area, not the light blue. Anyways, come up back here. And then we're gonna take this and go back to the city of the ancients. It's like, yeah. Like, I wonder how people would figure this out years ago. I don't even know remember how I did. I think I just literally looked around until I got bored. Now it's time to go talk to Boogie Hagen. Because now that we have the key to the ancients, it's time to uh, figure out what the hell else we're gonna do. Because we don't know if Holy's gonna save us. If it was our Earth, yeah, we'd be screwed. Humanity would suck. Anyways, with the key to the ancients found, we go up back here and talk to Boogie Hagen. Boogie Hagen, we bring you the key to the ancients. Oh, oh you found it! I need something to drink. That music box over there. We'll put the key in it. I'm gonna use the key. You all wait here and watch closely what happens. Okay. <laughs> Weird looking key. Whoa. Oh, it's one of those pre rendered cutscenes. Oh, this is gonna be good. Catastrophe, a keyblade, dragon balls, what? This was just a screen to project an image. Look, look at the image projected on the screen of the water. 
Ooh, more pre-rendered cutscenes. Let's go. Be saved. He would be might. It's glowing. Ho ho ho! It's pale green. Eric, Eric is all you freak. After I gave up the black and beauty of Sephiroth, Eric's words came to me in my dreams. She said she was the only one who could stop Sephiroth. And do that, there was a secret here. That was holy. That's why she had to wait in fear. Eric knew about fear. And what she had to do. Translations. Earth has left us great hope. It cost her her life, her future. I'm sorry, Earth. I should have figured this out sooner. We left by saying where it was also sudden. I couldn't think. That's why it took so long for me to find out. But Earth, I don't understand now. Earth, I'll do the rest. Not I, Dirkus. We. But Earth left us. We shouldn't waste. <laughs> Yuffie to clear up the mood. Thank you, Aerith. Aerith's voice has already reached the planet. Just look at the glow of the white material. What about Holy? How come Holy isn't moving? Why? Something's getting in its way. Him. He's the only one that can do it. Sephiroth, where are you? So... Yeah. We leave and now we fit up. Ah, here's the phone call. What the? Sorry, I was a little surprised. What happened? Remember when the Jiron can disappeared? Actually, Rufus moved it. Move that big thick where? Why? Rufus wants to destroy Sephiroth with it. That cannon operates on huge material. But the huge material was already been used in the rocket plant. So since the cannon is useless right now, he decided to move it. To a place where materia know where Mako is gathered. And where is that? What do you think it is, Cloud? There's only like one place on this freaking planet that has the materia needed, or the Mako needed, in order to fire that freaking F off cannon. Where do you think it is? Just the reactor's output. I see. Don't worry about just the reactor. Once you open up all the way, everything will go full speed. <laughs> the princess sure done it this time. The whole idea that Mir will disappear for you to be set for is all wrong. Did you ever remember Mr. President? It was all my idea to fire my car shell. Will the shells really reach the northern border? <laughs> of course. But not. Mr. President, let's not call it a mock pen. This new weapon is called. What? The sister ray? Oh shit, I was right. Okay, crap. So we need to head to Midgard. Like, pronto! Because, good lord, we have no idea what that thing will do by firing a giant F off cannon into Sephiroth. Who knows? Maybe it'll just piss him off. Maybe he's like, you know what? Screw it. Let's just accelerate this crap further. So what we. Hmm. Ah, crap. What the? Oh, there it is. They did add it. I was wrong. Ah, oh, crap. It's one of the weapons. And it's moving. 
Very, very slowly. Like, very slowly. Oh, no. Oh, crap. What's wrong? It's a strange signal. It's a weapon. From where? It's coming from this person? Whoa. Hey. This is rising. This ain't good. When he came out to see his head straight from Vegar, the new weapon should stop it, right? I don't know if it's ready or not. Hey, what's gonna happen for me? Don't you worry. No, I'm just gonna see a place. She's with my parents and mama. Where? Actually, I think they got moved to Kong. If I remember correctly. What was that scratching just now? As long as my lady says, you're gonna care as well as I have it, right? I've been just saying this to you for a while now. When you blew up the second one, you had how many do you think died? That's for life of the planet. We all expected to be casualties. A few? What do you mean a few? Or well, maybe a few tears in it because those who died. Protected planet. Ha! That sure sounds good. And none of you, and no one will go against you. You really think you do whatever you want, right? I don't like hear that from no one in Shinra. Can't do anything about that. Stop it! Can't see. Can't cheat. Barrett, he knows what he did. But we did admit our camp gone. We forgot for no matter the reason. Right? You haven't forgotten, right? I know you. You can't quit the country because you're worried about the people in Vegar, right? Alright, let's go. We'll beat weapon ourselves. Uh, maybe we can win against that monster. We got a chance of winning, right? How would I know? But that's no reason for us to just let him go. We're going to Midgar and fight weapon. Come on, let's move. Jesus, you can hear that thing from here. Oh, that's why, because it's right here. And here's the thing. You can't... Fight the snake in the sea. I.e., if you try. Hey, what are you trying to break the island? Let's fight on the ground. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, so you have to fight it on the ground. So this gives you the chance to build your team in order to fight the weapon. And here's the thing weapon is going to take a while to get here, so let's customize our team real quick. Yuffie's in Fury, Tifa's fine. But here's the thing, I might just do God Guns just to show off Tifa's level 4 limit break right away. Because here's the thing, we're going to be waiting here for a while, waiting for this thing to show up. But... We have Fruit Code! So, let's make a diamond weapon, because that's what this is. Come here fast. Here's the thing, I think Dynamite is actually a move to physical attack. I'm not entirely sure if it isn't a or if it is. But we're gonna find out. Diamond weapon, eh? Okay, hey, little bitch. Come on, what you got? Huh? Let's go. Let's go. What you got, huh? Time for a boss battle. And time for me to mute the music because this game sucks when it comes to it. But here's what I say when I think diamond weapons immune to physical attacks. Because look, here I'm going to attack. Yeah, zero. 
Oh god, boy, this thing's massive. What's he, he how many push-ups did he do? How many chin-ups did he do? Wait. <laughs> uh, yeah, barely did anything. Let's call Neo Bahamut. Cause, screw you, I'm not do dealing with this crap. Oh yeah, I'm immune to fire. Mm, how much did mine do? Not that much more. <laughs> so yeah, Tifa is actually kind of useless in this battle, regardless if you want to say, oh, her thing's super awesome. Because it's time for Neo Bahamut! <laughs> Let's go! Oh my good lord, this thing is massive! Let's go, this thing is Bahamut! <laughs> you dare challenge me? Tetra Flare! Okay, that did a lot of damage, like a lot, a lot. Bahamut Zero. So we're gonna see Bahamut Zero now. Terra Flare! <laughs> I, I did the wrong one. I said the wrong one. Oh, good lord. It's got attack from space! Oh, good lord. Look at this thing! Look at this summon! Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! I want all of you to look at it! <laughs> boop, boop, boop. They're up there! He's got attacked from the fucking moon! This is the power of a hundred motherfucker! Good lord, this thing is still going. Look at it. Freaking nuke everything. 7,000? Is that enough to kill you? No, it's not. Oh, death sentence doesn't matter. Because, you know, we're that strong and we know. Countdown? The hell? Uh oh. You gotta shoot another fireball. Fireball! <laughs> yes, attack the person who will take zero damage from the fireball. Ah, uh, crap. Well, we're doing a lot of damage to it. Like, we've done almost 12,000 damage. No, we've done more than 12,000 damage. The bolt 3, I guess. 3,293. Bolt 3 again. More damage. How are you not dead? Kohane, motherfucker! Let's end this on Bahamut, can we? Can we end this on Bahamut? Hey, you dead? You dead? Yes, let's go! There probably is something you could have stolen from it. I really don't care. But eh, AMP plus, Bahamut mail up. Ooh, dang, a lot of mail up. Oh, dang. Oh, no. Ah, crap. What is he gonna do now? Oh, no. Hey, where are you going? Don't you ignore me! Looks like Tate's real. Doesn't it want to fight us? No. It's feeling something. Yeah, it senses murder. Oh crap, pre ready good Let's go to the airship! Oh god, this is so slow. And it's also so awkward. Oh hey! Oh no! Let's hurry out of here! Something big. I'm talking really big, Scubbin. I think he's talking into Rufus. <laughs> Mr. President, preparation for Sister Rare are now underway. Ha ha ha, Every, anytime is fine. <laughs> Fire. Oh. Look at this power. Look at all that power. 
Cannot be good for the planet, right? Like, like at all? I mean, look at this. He's draining the whole city of Midgard just to fire one cannon but shot. Look at this. Three, two, one. Fire! <laughs> Bang! So awesome they needed to do it four times. Well, I'm pretty sure someone in Midgard's dead. If not for the freaking force generated from that blast, from the freaking energy, the blast, the structure surrounding it fired off. Oh, that can't be good. Like at all. Like that can't be good at all. Which structure is it going to attack? Midgar! Oh crap. Mine! Oh boy. Yeah, let's get out of here. Uh, how big is this giant F off laser? Well, it's big enough to pierce this thing right the frig through. So, Shinra's two for two on the weapons. They took him down in one shot each. Well, to be fair, they missed the first shot, but they didn't, they didn't take the first hit. Damn. And went right through weapon. I see. They're after Sephiroth. They're created on the northern boundary. Oh, boy. Power of Shinra, Mago, and Energy. Boom. Whoa. Sir, weapon's been defeated. The barrier has disappeared. Sir, a massive high density energy is heading towards Midgar. What? He's like, ha, ah, finally. Well, weapons are you rough your lives. You really were your father, weren't you, Rufus? What happened to Sephiroth? Northern Cave? Let's go see what happened to it. So let's head off to Northern Crater. Let's see what everyone thinks about this. Now we're gonna go to fight Sephiroth. I know what's inside the cave looks like. I think Sephiroth's just sitting there waiting for a meteor. When that alliance was starting out, we used to put a flies there. And now we're up against Sephiroth. How about that? Feels like a long time ago. Catch she? I wonder what Sephiroth's up to. We will save the world if we beat Sephiroth. I'm frying it, but I'll do my best. Let's hurry up to the Northern Cave. Kill it, Sephiroth. Kill yourself and my beloved woman. Am I on the verge of committing another sin? Or am I returning at best for it? Uh, uh, or am I returning as best as I can for only standing by? Let's go check on Yuffie. I'm pretty sure the music will change. Yep! There's the music. Hey, Yuffie! What's the pilot like? Tell me Yuffie says if he pilots that place really, I'll give him my autograph. <laughs> Yuffie still thinking she's more hot shit than she actually is. Anyways, maybe this is the time. He's learning to pilot all of our team. Let's go! Alright, so now it's time to go check out the Northern Ca Crater. Hopefully, it's something we can stop and defeat. Now, if you go here beforehand, you'll actually be propelled backwards because the barrier will just actively go bop, bop, bop. No, you're not coming in. Sephiroth, the energy barrier is gone. Sid, can the airship get inside? Huh? He's my pilot, and of course he could go anywhere. Right. Sorry about that. Uh-oh. Yo, Kachi, now what? Oh, no. Hold it. 
Scott Heidegger, what's going on? This can't be good. Strange. I can't reach the president. Not the president, to Sister Ray. What is it really? You're speaking strangely. None of that matters. The reactor output is increasing all by itself. Wait a minute. That's not wise. It must cool for three hours or it won't work. Reef, shut off the machine. We can't do it. It's inoperable. So I switched the machine over to the mainframe operation. We can't operate it from here. What about the mainframe? <gasps> hey, call the mainframe! Huh? Why are you giving me orders? I don't care how you do it. Who is operating the mainframe cannon? Oh, fucking course it's Hojo! <laughs> just you wait, up. I'll give you all the mako you want. I'll just stop. No, this guy himself is in danger. Be real of it. Ah, why are there two megas? It's a small price to pay. Hojo! Hojo! Hojo, you're in it, big god damn it! Show me, Saffron. Should be near. Go beyond the power of science. Before your presence, science is powerless. I don't like it, but I'll comply. Just let me see it. <laughs> ah, crap. Oh, yes, it's time for my favorite team in the game. No, I'm too sorry, you big cat. <laughs> We're sunk. Holjo is doing this on his own. Huh? like this. You're busted, Reed. Too late, try to hide it now. Can we stop the Mako reactor? Oh, uh, it's the bombing mission! Let's go! We can't stop it. You're from Sandra, ain't ya? So why is it impossible? We came a long way to get here. You better not double cross us now. I can't make you, trust me. You damn fool, don't you understand what I'm saying? I don't give a damn about Shinra. If you're a man, no. If you're a human being, you'll save the play. Don't you even care? No way, if we shut down the reactor, all hell will break loose. Why? Can't you just shut off the valve? Yeah, it's easy to shut off the reactor's pipe valve. But the reactor made a patch for the energy to escape from below. Once you open that, it's impossible to close it until everything blasts out. I, we can't try to stop the energy from gushing out. An explosion! That's a blast, and we wish harder than the, when the Sector 1 reactor blew up. Damn! We had that, the cannon. We got to get to make art. That's the first thing. Must stop. Hojo first. Woo! Looks like Cloud and the others are on his way. Stay out of the way. <laughs> Don't be foolish. I don't remember anyone putting you in charge. The Peace Preservation Force will do their best to beat the enemy. Because of them, I... I... That's a private matter. The president is dead. Now I'm doing things my way. <laughs> oh, fuck. Now I'm gonna use a new weapon. Oh, you guys are idiots. Yep. Hey, wait! Oh, there, everybody. Sorry. But! These guys are idiots. But, you'll come, won't you? I know. Ah oh, crap, I gotta turn the volume down because guess what? Freaking YouTube is gonna try to copyright the crap out of this song. Because I know they will, because they did it before! Hey, I'm leaving the ship in your hands. Man's crying tears of joy. I'm headed for Midgar. So, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna head for Midgar! Because now it's time to take down Shinra before they screw it up even more. I need Hojo, Scarlet, and Heidegger. Because they only care about lining their pockets and making sure that they cut look like they're on top. So, right now, we're just going to save. And that, ladies and gentlemen, will be it for this episode. No, we're not going to end the current game. Because, good lord, I had not saved in a while. It's been 40 minutes. We had one battle. It was against Diamond Weapon, sure, but we couldn't do anything. Ah, so with that everyone, my name is Omega Zero, and I will catch you all later. For next time, we are going to go dive bombing into Midgar.